Ex-Presidential Spokesperson Harry Roque says that former President Rodrigo Duterte received information that he could be arrested anytime in light of the International Criminal Court investigation on the country's war on drugs. In a Facebook Live, Roque says the information was relayed to him by the former president himself, which causes his insomnia. Tapos alam nyo ba ho, tatapating mo kayo, hindi ako nakatulog kasi tinawagan ako ni um, Tatay Digong at ang sabi niya, nakakuha siya ng informasyon na anytime daw baka siya arestuhin. Naku, ang, ang instinct ko tumakbo sa, sa Davao, eh sabi ko naman, ano man magagawa ko kung ako itatakbo doon, pero hindi talaga ako nakatulog. Roque adds that Duterte's claim on his arrest was corroborated by rumors of Davao Task Force disbandment due to its perceived loyalty to Duterte. O, siyempre, nag-amoy-amoy ako kung ano nangyari sa Davao. Abay, parang may katotohanan ang sinasabi niya dahil nakakahalap ako ng balita na i-disband daw ang Task Force Davao. Alam nila na loyal sa mga Duterte itong Task Force Davao so parang nagkaroon nga ng, uh, well, yan po ugu-u ngayon na bubogin daw ang Task Force Davao. The Armed Forces of the Philippines, however, denied Roque's pronouncements about the Task Force Davao. Duterte declared the country's withdrawal from the Rome Statute or the treaty which established the ICC in March 2018. The withdrawal took effect a year after. Despite this, the ICC retained jurisdiction over alleged crimes in the Philippines from November 1, 2011 to March 16, 2019, while the country was still a state party. President Marcos earlier said that the Philippines does not recognize the ICC's jurisdiction but said that investigators can come and visit the country as ordinary people.